Dhalavira This is the newcomer to modern civilization. It was discovered in 1989-90. This is a city on an island of Gujarat in the realm of Kutch. It was a pretty large city one can say it was 60 hectares in extent and the most important feature of Dholavira is that it has preserved its stone culture in an excellent way there is an excellent preservation of stone culture and uh, Dholavira like the other typical indus cities also had a walled acropolis it had a walled acropolis like mohenjo-daro and harappa its walls and buildings are made of mud bricks but stones substitute for fire bricks this area uh, there was plenty of stone right so stones substitute for fire bricks and it had the typical indus town planning parallel roads uh, water supply through tanks and wells and it also had the largest indus inscription it also has the largest indus inscription ma'am uh, both dholavira and lothal uh, seems to have uh, i mean a close proximity to the sea so i mean based on this which was more important uh, i think so, lothal yeah. was more important as a seaport dholavira of course had access to the sea also but we hear of lothal being the more important a uh, commercial point i mean is that i mean do we get enough evidence to i mean uh, in in uh, like uh, artifacts and all uh, yes yes certainly because we do come across you know precious stones like lapis lazuli and mm-hmm. carnelian mm-hmm. and turquoise that have been found in um, abundance in, in abundance in lothal they also knew the art of making uh, holes in beads which is what made this region into a very prosperous area right and dhola vira the excavations have just started in 1990 so further excavations will you know uh, reveal will unravel rather you know uh, more artifacts maybe and then we will be able to say much more about the status of dhola vira right <laughs> Another important site is uh, Sutkajen Dor. Close to Sutkajen Dor is Sotka Ko. You can find both these places from the map. This is on Dasht River near Pakistan's frontier with Iran. And close to Sutkajen Dor, uh, there is a fortified enclosure. And this enclosure has been made by joining two natural ridges two natural ridges by thick walls made of stone blocks that is set in mud and sutka gendor as you can understand is also very close to the sea it is also very close to the sea now sotka ko we do not have much information about this place but uh, this is in the shadi kaur valley shadi kaur valley Uh, it remains largely unexcavated but to a large extent it resembles sutkar gen door but maybe in future we will find more information about this re-